This is Viewpoints Explained. I'm Ebony McMorris. Every 10 years, millions of Americans take part in the U.S. Census. The nationwide poll helps the government figure out how best to distribute trillions of dollars to places like schools, social services, public parks, and more. If you filled out a census from before, you may remember a question about race. There are several options to choose from, like white, African-American, Asian, Native, Hawaiian, and more. These categories are socially constructed and change over time. For the Census Bureau, data on race helps to paint a better picture of the country and can help reallocate resources to better assist minority populations. However, considering the importance of this question, some feel it's still exclusionary. In 2022, nearly 4 million U.S. residents, excluding undocumented immigrants and refugees, identified as Middle Eastern and North African. Yet there's no clear category for this classification. That is until now. This year, the U.S. Census changed the race identification, adding Middle Eastern and North African as a category with six ethnic subcategories, including Lebanese, Egyptian, Syrian, Iranian, Iraqi, and Israeli. What do you think about this change? Are these divisions becoming too complex, or is it a natural and needed progression? The next U.S. Census is set to take place in 2030. That's Viewpoints explained for this week. More in a moment.